welcome to BHC today on this Friday, the 20th of November. I'm Pastor Tim. The Apostle Paul writes in uh, Philippians 3, 20 and 21, our citizenship is in heaven, but we eagerly await a savior from there, the Lord Jesus Christ, who by the power that enables him to bring everything under his control, will transform our lowly bodies so that they will be like his glorious body. You know, later this morning, we're going to be honoring Regina Wheeler in a memorial service here at Bellevue Heights Church. She's moved on to that heavenly citizenship, having patiently awaited the, the call home from our Savior into his very presence. How exciting for Regina to now be a citizen of heaven. You know, citizenship's an important thing. We value our citizenship here in the U.S. My daughter-in-law came here from Brazil, but she is now anxiously studying and preparing for that test of citizenship so that she can also become a citizen of the United States of America. Now, there are all kinds of privileges and opportunities available to those of us who are, are citizens, and we shouldn't take that lightly. I know there are those who don't have those privileges and they try all sorts of ways to get in here, even sometimes illegally. But you know, whether we are citizens of the US or of uh, Brazil or any other country, the most exciting, fulfilling and lasting is the one that comes because we know and love the Lord Jesus Christ. And that's a citizenship in heaven with our Lord. So this morning, while we will celebrate Regina's life, She's the one celebrating her new citizenship. And we praise God for her faithfulness and her ministry. And we eagerly await our citizenship in heaven as well. Let's pray. Father, thank you for the great hope that we have, even as Regina had and as she's experiencing now. May we as well look forward to that citizenship that's awaiting for us as believers with great joy and anticipation. We thank you in Jesus' name. Amen.